Hey everyone, so the Lost Riches event is now out. Uh, so I just decided to make a little video on this, talking about the event, if I, say, if I think the uh, rewards are good, and how to do it. Uh, so first we're going to start off with the possible rewards, because that's what everyone here cares about. And, I mean, yeah, the, the rewards I think are really good. You have the little pet option you can get. You get a blue Sealy, a pink Sealy, or a yellow one. Um, you can get books, enhancement ores, and Mora. Now, if we take a look at the shop here, you can get up to 300 gems, which is really good um, for the event. You can get up to 20 enhancement ores. You can get 10 books and over 200k Mora. And then probably the main prize for everyone here is either the Primo gems or the mini Sealies. Um, so you only can pick up one of these, just so you know. You can either get the yellow one, the blue one, or the pink one. Um, it's all up to you which you want to pick. Uh, I think this one's golden instead of yellow. Uh, so yeah, I mean the shop is really decent. You can get up to, I think, 60 iron coins per the event. Uh, so every treasure area, you, so the first treasure area, you get 60 of them. And each one unlocks every 12 hours. So you get two every 12 hours. There's a treasure area. You have to explore treasure area three to unlock the special treasure. Um, so this is just a nice little event that they added extra for us to do. Uh, I mean, there's nothing really special about it. It's, it is it is something different. Uh, it's something rather than just killing an enemy and uh, opening a box for rewards. We're actually trying to look for a treasure, uh, so which is really interesting. So I'm going to go ahead and show some gameplay of the Lost Riches event here. All right, so the first area here is going to be Falcon Coast. It says it on the top left. You do, if you don't know the map inside out, which, you know, I already do. I literally could look at any part of the map and, like, I know where exactly where that is. Um, but it does tell you it is in Falcon Coast. So you're going to want to head over into Mondstadt, where I'm at currently right now. And it's going to, you're just going to head and pop on this domain. Or you can go to this waypoint. Uh, it depends on, doesn't really matter. You have the Statue of the Seven here if you need to heal and stuff. Uh, but Falcon Coast is going to be head on the right side of the map. As soon as you enter Falcon Coast, you can see in the bottom right of your screen, the area for the Sealy is going to pop up, and there's going to be this gold thing right here. You go ahead and dig, and there you go, there's some iron coins. So the first area is going to be right here. I do not know if it changes for each person. Um, so basically, as soon as you go to that domain, literally jump straight off, it's going to be on this track. It's going to be right here. I don't know if it changes for each uh, person, and if the spawns are random i'm not quite sure um but if you guys find the same exact location for me which is right here uh then please let me know so we know that uh the locations are not randomly generated it's nothing really too special there's nothing really about it you're just going to run around until you until you see it start to glow there you go it's starting to glow and as soon as you see it starts to glow you'll get the dig option of course it's very hard to miss so there we got some iron coins there we go another dig spot some more coins Another dig spot, some more coins, some iron chunks. So we're just going to head and follow the Sealy around until you end up getting all 60 coins. There's 8 coins right there. And there is the last spot. Bam. So once you go ahead and find all the hidden coins in the area, you're going to go ahead and pull up your event tab here. You're going to head into the event details. And then you'll be able to get the second treasure area. And now, as I said, you can get 60 of these uh, per run, I believe. So make sure you guys do this. Um, and before the event goes away because there is some good rewards in there as I said 300 primo gems uh, And there's some extra enhancement or some books and of course the main prize being that cute little pet that you'll be able to acquire So that's gonna do it for the lost riches event. Let me know what you guys think of this event down in the comment section uh, Personally for me. I feel like it's something small. Yes, it's not too big You're not getting a free weapon like we did for the last event However, this is something that's cool. I mean, there's 300 Primo gems for free, basically, for you walking around and clicking F to pick up some items and iron coins or whatever. Um, but yeah, it's, it's nice. The reward, obviously, is the cute pet. So let me know what you guys think in the comment section below about this event. Thank you, everyone, for watching, and I hope you guys have a wonderful, wonderful day. Peace out.